I know you have a, something in the works releasing that information. Are you comfortable now uh, discussing what what you saw happen to Giancana? That's always been kind of murky. What the uh, the situation behind his well, murder? It was, it was his uncle that told them what he. Yeah, when the three hundred two. But I, I, my dad had told me one time, but it was my uncle. 302s where okay. I learned exactly what it was, okay? And then I had a conversation with my brother, Kurt, too, because my uncle had told my brother, Kurt. But it was my uncle's 302s. So I got a lot. I'm in possession of a lot of stuff from my father's belongings because rightfully it went to me. But I think the government might have accidentally, I don't know if they did or not, left a lot of stuff in there that I shouldn't have got. So I learned a lot from all that. Um, I did not know, other than what my father had told me, prior to that okay and it's a whole story so, I mean, you want me to go into it real quick or do you want to i, I, I would i would like yeah that. doesn't it doesn't it implicate tony <laughs> and implicate, it implicates tony accardo i think it, it does so it, and, and and look i wasn't there my dad wasn't there my uncle wasn't there okay so you know i'm just telling you what i was told and it made sense and that's what i tell people okay first of all look at tony accardo Here's a man that never did a night in jail. Here's a very man that knew how to kill. Here's a man that's trying to go legit with everything. I mean, this is one of the most powerful mob bosses where he was trying to take over the years, right? I'd say I'd say he's the most powerful mafia boss in American history. That's my personal okay. opinion. Very you, could, you could argue you could argue some guys from New York, but I don't think anybody in terms of longevity and pound for bound, top pound for pound, top to bottom shot calling. I don't think anybody uh, reaches the cardo master manipulator right <laughs> he got bill romer to love him but yet tony spalaccio bill romer hated him and made it personal okay that tony cardo didn't trust romer he didn't trust the fbi it was all just like they were doing it was a game of chess back and forth okay trying to work things out tony was very smart now when sam when they felt Sam had a goal for a lot of reasons, okay? Everybody says it was his 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 um, bodyguard, trusted best friend, Butch Blassie, yeah. or it was Tony Spilatro. Spilatro, yeah. What I look at is this, and this is what I was told. When I'm telling you this, I'm telling you this through my dad and my uncle and sitting with them, which which I learned, which makes sense. You're going to – Sam Giancana was a very treacherous man, and he was a very smart man. He knew he fell out of favor. OK, so in this life, if you get whistled for and you don't come, you're dead. Right. Do you think Tony's going to whistle for him? Sam ain't dead dumb. Right. OK, so what did Tony do? He sets up something where he's going to come to his house alone. Right. F FBI, local police sitting outside. You think he's going to let Tony Spilatro in? Butch Blassie was close with him. And this is what I don't know. OK, what Butch Blassie's party said he never wanted to talk about it on any 302s or anything. I'll never talk about that murder. And, you know, you, Butch Blassie is not happy with the new mob now. OK, and the way they're treating Sam and him. So are you, Tony Accardo, going to trust Butch Blassie? You can't trust anybody because you're 60. What was he? 63, I think. 63 or 66. My, 63, my age. Because if something falls through, you're going to jail for the rest of your life. Right. OK, who knows more on Tony than Sam? So you set up a meeting where you want to come to the house and, and, and you want to talk about, you know, the trial coming up in a couple of weeks. So how we got in, I don't know. OK, all right. Never talked about that. All I know was that it was a, 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 a 22 with a silencer and that it was Tony Cardo and that Tony dropped the gun in a bad place. He didn't mean for it to be found. OK, 22 doesn't have a big kick on it. All right. Now, how in the 302, it was Angelo telling my dad and my uncle, the old man, never too old for heavy work, heavy work, mm. killing somebody. Now, if you yes. well, let me ask one more thing or let me just interject this that to me could be a indicator of a Cardo's presence. So we know that Giancana was shot in the back of the head while he was preparing a meal. 
of sausage, sausage and peppers. peppers. Sausage. Now, he turned yeah, his right. back on somebody he trusts, trusted, right? And he was cooking. I feel like in other situations, somebody would be cooking for Sam. Since Tony Accardo was over Sam, Sam was cooking for Tony. I don't know. That's just my, again, my uh, my quick uh, I mean, um, insight into um, the potential that that. That, that, that little fact thing, could, could lend merit to them. Going on. The, the, you know, they said, well, the police the police left for a few minutes. Well, let me tell you something. You know, the oldest trick in the book is you take somebody and you go and you, and you call and say you see a robbery going on or you see an officer got shot, you know. And what do they do? They leave the scene of surveillance and then they come back a few minutes later. You only need that few minutes. I'm not saying that was done. I'm yeah. just telling you, trying to think through what I learned and who I am. I don't know. My guess, and this is a guess that maybe it was Butch Blassie that let him in. Butch Blassie didn't want to know. Maybe Butch Blassie let him in and left. Okay. But I feel that the only person that Sam would have been comfortable with and would have met for a reason would have been Tony. Now, everybody argues to this day about it. To me, that's pure Tony Accardo. That's his smarts. If you, if you, right now, if somebody says, I was there and I seen Tony do it, people would still doubt it. If the yeah. person was really there, that's what Tony wanted. Put doubt in people's mind. Very, very smart man. Mm -hmm.